What is going on, everybody? And welcome to the first episode of Hi, I'm Hungry, a new series here on Pine Park, where we're going to be traveling around LA and hopefully other areas soon, trying the best food out here and seeing what it's got, man. We're at an iconic spot right now. You see the palm trees, you see the skateboarders, you see the people walking, biking. We're at Venice Beach, baby. And on Venice Beach, right next to the sign, we got a little spot called Teddy's Tacos. They got some birria. I always have trouble pronouncing that, Beery, but they got Beery, some birria. Yeah, 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 yeah. The tacos yeah. that you dip, you've seen them on TikTok and YouTube and everything like that. They look amazing. It's all drippy and tasty and crispy. Got nice meat in it. We're gonna learn a little bit more about birria. We're gonna see if this uh, taco spot holds up to the test, man. I got Tim with me from Secret Sesh and the podcast. Let's try some fucking tacos, man. I'm high and hungry. Let's do this, man. Let's go. For those of you who don't know what birria tacos are, they're very popular right now. I'm sure you've seen them. It's slow cooked, either beef or goat on the inside. I think I'm gonna go with the beef. Yeah, yeah, beef, 100%. Yeah, I'm a beef kind of guy. I think the traditional way is the goat, though. How like it's done in Mexico and everything. Uh, so you get that, and then you get a fried tortilla shell, and you get a whole bunch of goodies on top, and then the consomme dip as well. Yeah, and you get yourself a little meal right there, man. Yeah, and what's awesome is is you know this started in like the 1970s with street vendors. Um, small restaurants, you know, it's kind of, kind of, kind of niche, you know, not a, not a big, broad audience. But now it's like hype beast foodies, TikTok stars, everyone scum from Optic making them at home. Everybody's having birria tacos. I think it's our turn to try these things. Man. Damn near, man. Here we are right now at Teddy's Red Taco, bro. I think I'm we're gonna excited. get a, we get a sampler or something. We got some. I might just get one of everything. I, I need to try it all, but I'm, I'm specifically excited for that birria, man. I need that. Ooh, I need that. Let's, let's see do what this. we got. what we got right here, man. Check it out right there. This is where the dip goes, I imagine. Get a little, a little, that's the birria taco. Please get this, the deluxe plate. Onion, cilantro, and hot sauce? Uh, yes, please, all of it. Can I do another deluxe plate and then a Mexican Coke, please, and thank you. I appreciate it. What's the history of Teddy's, man? Teddy Vasquez, uh, he was an Uber driver and Smart guy, all right? Because he wanted to sell these tacos. And how the big brain play was while he Ubered, in the trunk, like I said, in the trunk, he put freshly cooked birria. Ooh, so the birria meat that was fresh in, smell just it was permeating, like, right? And then you're driving, you're, you're a passenger in the Uber, you're like, yo, oh, what's that fire smell going on in here? And then he would he would hustle his taco. He'd be like, yo, actually, I got this taco. And then eventually somebody was riding in there and they owned a business and they let Teddy set up a stand outside, and that was okay. the spawn of, of the taco. Teddy's little tacos, Teddy, man. Teddy's red tacos. Wow, that's incredible. I wonder if anyone ever got annoyed. They're like, bro, I don't want tacos. I'm sure somebody was crazy. like, man, what the hell's going it on It smells insane here? in the car. You just long day, I would have been stoked, because I would have been stoned. I would have gotten in the car and been like, yo. Please, there's no way you got tacos in the back. That's like the <laughs> best Uber. Sometimes they give you like hand sanitizer, like they let like you a, charge your phone. Yeah. Like a, maybe a cookie. He's like, bro, I got candy. fucking burrito tacos in the back. I'd cream. That's right, crazy. Um, let's try these, yeah? Let's try it, man. We got the taco right here, and then a mulita right here. Mm. Are these the tacos? tacos? We got the tacos, the mulita, and then a little a queso taco probably or something like that. Yeah. I think I'm going taco. I'm going taco too. Let's do it. Right amount of onions and everything on there. Oh wait, gotta get the hot sauce on there, brother. This shit looks oh, spicy oh, as fuck. Oh, the hot sauce too. I didn't even know. You gotta dress it proper. Okay, so I'm just going check that first. shit out. I'm a nut. Damn, you're, you're that's 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 a lot. Okay, we're going here. <laughs> more more realistic. That's aggressive. What? We're dipping. we're dipping. Let's get a good dip in. Get that. Oh, oh wow. Let me get a good dip in. Double dipping. Yep, got to. Cheers, cheers. man. No cheers. That's ridiculous. The amount of flavor that you just get, it's like an insane amount of just flavor. And every single taste bud is like hitting something right now. I don't even know what the words say. Like the spicy, Besides, the savory. I think I needed more salsa because we're getting the spice now. I told you. I told you. Because mm -hmm. a lot of it, move. honestly, I think I'm going to put salsa after I dip because I think I lost my salsa. Mm -hmm. And that's what it was. I'm coming up with different scratch. I'm going to go dip, and then I'm going to go, ooh. 
Ooh. Uh, you're honestly okay. Ridiculous. It's like crisp on the edges of the tortilla. The veggie crisp. The vegetables are fresh too. The onions. Everything was just fresh. It wasn't sitting in a go container for right. eight hours. You know? Yeah. It's all right there. This is crazy. Flavor wise, flavor wise, man, it's just off the chart right now. Like my mouth doesn't really know what to do. It's salivating. Like if I, I'm, if I didn't keep swallowing, I'd start drooling. Oh yeah. Like salivating. I'm doing Insane. it. I'm doing it. Oh yeah. Makes it warm. Gets you feeling nice into the inside. Yo, fuck. That's that should be illegal. That is too good. That is too good. Ooh. I'm almost looking forward to this crunch right here though too. Oh nice. A little crunchy. Wow, 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 wow. I know wow. Where I'm going. There's just so many places to go right now. I'm so impressed. I'm so impressed. A lot of crisp. I want taco again. You're right. We gotta go. We gotta go crunch. I kind of don't know what I'm gonna like the most though. If I'm gonna like the taco the most, because the taco kind of set a standard right there. That's like. Yeah, that was insane. I don't really know how. I think it set a dip. I'm gonna scoop. Yeah, scoop. Right. Oh, I'm gonna go deep. Oh, yeah. oh once we're stuck. Oh, stuff. you got a little bit of beef a in there. Meat huh? in there, huh? The beef broth is the way. Oh it shit! Is. It's breaking. Oh shit! It's breaking. Uh oh. Uh oh. I gotta go now. I gotta go now. <laughs> Yeah, definitely. Wow. I like the crunch, but I don't like the, I like the, the taco shell. It's just, it's easier to handle. Factor. Easier Mine's to doing hand. well. Mine's doing well right now. You're just holding up solid. Maybe you I just have a, handle it or something. Yeah, man. Got you gotta have soft hands. Mmm. You gotta got taco there. hands. You got in there too aggressive. <laughs> this is insane. The crisp is really something else. This crispy? Oh my God, that is too. Oh, brother. They crisp it up perfect here. Texture's a big thing. You're a texture guy, right? Huge texture guy. If it's a, it's an odd texture, man. It's it's hard to enjoy, you know. It, it's and people can put that aside. I simply cannot. I can't do soggy. Can't do like slimy. This is where it's at. This is where it's at. These are cool too. I don't even know what that. What do you do with this? Get some little extras. Come out. This is a little chippy chip. Kind of just go like that. Damn near. Oh, do a little dip action. Oh, I wish I got a little bit more. Come on, give me some. Give me some. There you go. I like that. I like this. It was ridiculous. You like the best $18 that I've ever spent. Is that, is that uh, cost wise? What's a, what's a platter? Uh, three deluxe plates, 50 bucks. No, but what's the cost individual? Oh, it doesn't say it? Yeah, it doesn't say it. You gotta do some math here. Like 15? Yeah, it's like $15.99. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. We're pretty close. Amazing. And where are we going? We're getting four items, a little extra chippies, yeah. and consomme. Consomme. Come on now. I think these are the most popular form of what everyone sees though, yeah? These queso burrito tacos or something like that, because there's a little bit of cheese in there, you get the slow cooked beef, it's everything you need in there. I'm going salsa first, I'm going salsa first. Oh, check that shit. Oh, Jesus. Mm. Wow. It's like the opposite texture, it's soft because of the cheese. Wow. I think I like the crunch more, but this is tasty. The cheese is, yeah. The cheese is just. The it. cheese brings something out for surely. Wow. This is a molita. I mean, it's like the same stuff the slow cooked beef and all those little extra herbs and everything. And then it's between two smaller tortillas. Okay. Also fried, a little bit of crisp. Mm -hmm. What do we got in here? I'm not mad at that. It barely going, fits. I'm going it barely no fits. dip. I'm going no dip. No dip, huh? Respect. Wow. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh Thanks. brother. I don't even know what to say right now. It almost leaves you speechless. They're all good in their own way. This might be the best of all the worlds. If you get a score, if you get a score. We're going like out of 10? Out of 10. 10 tacos out of 10 so, tacos. Okay, so we're going, we're going hex taco factors, right? So meat. Fillings, everything, five. Salsa's five. You get to rate both of those. Oh. So I'm gonna go to meat. Everything is like, like four. It's really good. Mm -hmm. The salsa's hitting though. Mm -hmm. Salsa might be 4.5. Mm -hmm. I'm saying it's a nine and a half out of 10. I think four plus four and a half is eight and a half. What did I say? No, I said, what did I say? 
Is this four and a half and then four? Can I say five? Fuck, dude. That's a good score. I'm gonna give it an eight eight. 8.8. .8. I feel like it's really good. It's on the verge of being, and I don't know what would bring it over. I'm trying to. I feel like this needed to be more crunchy. I don't know oh, if we yeah. waited too long. Maybe yeah. we should have ate the crunchy ones first. Mm -hmm. And that, that I'm lacking food technique, and maybe that's on me. But th the Melita a little crunchier, like this crunchy. Oh. Because I like I, I like sticking that in there. I like yeah. I like that. Yeah. Yeah, true. Nine plus is a tough score to reach. We're not we're not being too heavy, but like a ten's oh, almost impossible. Awesome. You know? right there now. Hey, it's alright. Things happen, man. This is high. I'm hungry. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Hey, if you guys have ever tried Teddy's, let us know what you think, man. Is our score accurate? Is it up an upper echelon of Berea and we just need to get out there and we'll realize that it's like a nine and a half or something like that? Or just really how it gets. I, I fuck with it. I'm not mad at this at all. This shit's amazing, man. I'm, I'm so hot. <laughs> Dude, I don't know what that is. I'm drinking the fucking so. Drink that shit. This stuff is amazing. Make sure to go check it out. And make sure to let us know in the comments what place we should go to next, whether it's in Venice, whether it's in the greater LA area. We'll head out there, get a little stoned, and try some uh, try some tacos and good food. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. Later, guys. Good. Please, oh, eat this, please. I feel like... Yeah, please. Eat it. Cameraman's gotta eat.